Hi, Timothy Unger here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to insert a math equation into a Google Doc. So I have a blank Google Doc open, and let's say I want to insert a math equation. I can just go up to the toolbar here, find Insert, go on down to Equation, and now I'm inserting an equation. And there's a faint blue outline. You probably can't see it in the video, but that tells me that I'm in the equation. So let's say I want to create a function. Uh, I can just start typing f of x equals, and let's say I want to do x squared. I can do x, so I do shift 6 to get the superscript, uh, put the 2, and then I can arrow out of it with the arrow key. Then I could do like a plus 6, and let's say I want to get out of the equation, I just arrow out with the arrow key. Okay. Once I create an equation and I still have my document open, this new equation toolbar will appear, which will make it a little bit quicker to create another equation. So let's create another one. So I'm going to click New Equation. Type in, uh, let's say, g of x. And let's say I want to do a fraction. I also, on this toolbar, have a bunch of different symbols that will appear. So let's do 1 over, let's say 1 over the square root of x. So what I can do is go back here, find the square root, and do 1 over the square root of x and I can arrow out of this equation once I'm done. Now, if I close out the document and then reopen, you'll see I still have my equations, but I don't have the toolbar to quickly get into a new equation. But that's very easy. I just go back to insert, go back on down to equation, and now I'm back in an equation and I can create some different equation. Let's say I wanna do x cubed, uh, divided by the cube root of x. Do all that. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a like and consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you in the next one.